Hey guys, so I just got home to see that I'm level 220, so I macroed overnight and then I macroed during the day. But I was hoping I'd be maxed by now. I'll make another video with Max Phoenix, but for now, I'll just show you guys a level 220 Phoenix in action and I'll show you the transformation and its skills. All right. Let's see. Oh, we spawned over here. All right, let's get over to the dummy training ground so I can show you guys. All right, here we go. Okay, uh, first move, you've seen me use it for mobility. It's called Fujizami. So the damage so far as a level 221 is 2.1 per tick and then 54 point. Who the hell? All right. Um, sorry about that. Okay, as I was saying, as I was saying, 2.1 per tick, and then it's a 54.7 final hit. Second move is Talon Slam. Oh my god, I didn't land that. Okay, we gotta wait for that to go back. Alright, second move, Talon Slam. 58.9 damage. That is pretty good. All right, Phoenix Inferno. I just need to move this log. Oh, I can't. Okay, I'll just take his dummy. So Phoenix Inferno is a barrage move. It can be used as a combo extender. That did 2.1 and 68.1 damage as the final hit. Fourth move, Bluebird. It's a range attack, 46.3. Okay, that's good. And if you see this bar on the right, that would be the, I guess you can say ultimate bar because it allows me to transform into a Phoenix and it changes all the movesets. So this guy here set the boss bond. So let's just go over there and uh, see how that work. There's a magma here. Ooh, that was some crazy lag. That guy needs to chill. Oh, I'm stuck in the ground. Oh, again, I'm stuck in the ground. Alright, so now that I have my awakening bar, alright, I'm gonna pop it. You press G to activate it. Then all your skill movesets change. So, first, Mujizami. It has a way big area of, of effect. Hawk Rush, it can basically be used as flight, but it can also hit people. So, let's see. See, 84.2 damage from just that. Phoenix Inferno, they change it so. Let's see. Ooh. Okay, that Phoenix Inferno was messed up. <laughs> Alright. There we go. That's how Phoenix Inferno looks. And then when you let go, it does a down slam. 
crazy damage. Fourth move, Bluebird. Um, it still shoots the same thing, except it shoots multiple. So one, two, three, four, five. It shoots out five beams. Also, your um, passive regen as a phoenix, as you can see up here. I don't know if you can, but yeah. Um, it's pretty good. So, let's see. Let's go find people. Oh, there we go. Another kill. This flying mechanic is extremely cool. It allows me to find a lot of people. Oh, there we go. It does have a pretty um, cooldown, though. But you just have to beat the heck out of people and then regain your bar. Which isn't too bad. I'm sorry, young one. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. When you see just from dying, you gain like 8.3%. I think it's based off of damage, so it could take long depending on who you're fighting. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That boy got the combos. I can't see crap. Alright, that guy's dead. There's another Magu. Where is he? There we go. Found him. Ooh. Is that him? Yep, that's him. Just blow down this tree. Oh, yes, we can. Got that guy up and straight down. And that's a kill right there. <laughs> Alright, KD 2%. Let's just go kill these guys for a bit. Oh, also you can combo into this, so we can use it as a range. Yep. Phoenix Inferno also has some pretty good range. barrier all right got my ult again gonna pop it all right hawk rush Let's see where everyone are hmm okay so you can't fly for long, but Hawk Rush doesn't have that long of a cooldown, so I don't mind. Oh. Anyone up here? No. There's someone. 
to another one. See if I can get him. This gets toxic. He didn't even survive until the town slam. No, I transformed back. All right, still got him though. All right, um, so that's the level 220 experience for Phoenix. I hope you guys like it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And if you want to see me play something else, please comment down below. All right, thank you.